most dudes you ever fucked in one go? I think 35. What? 35. Guys, yeah. They did 25. Private collection. Someone How's paid that work? for just this one video from you personally? Yeah, it was crazy. And you actually did it? Mm -hmm. Wow. Someone paid like how much Over money? Ridiculous amount of money. Like really? ridiculous. More than every guy. Five figures. Not five figures. Wait. <laughs> Counting the zeros. <laughs> I love it. Oh, yeah, yeah. 999. More than a thousand dollars for each guy. Okay. Yeah. Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Welcome to CN Take, man. My name is Jay Sin, coming back with another one, man. The most hot and woke us up this morning, man. Let's take this opportunity to be great, you know what I mean? Let's take this opportunity to be great, man. Look, you may not see the sun in the sky, but you can see the light. The sun is within us, you know what I mean? We woke up this morning, so we rose like the sun, man. But real quick, though, I wanted y'all to see that clip of Adriana Chechik, you know what I mean? She a porn star. And she's sitting there bragging about doing 35 dudes at once. And I know what y'all thinking. Like, yo, okay, she's a porn star. That's what she does. But look how proud of it she is. You know what I'm saying? Look how proud she is to talk about the amount of money she got for it. You know what I mean? Which she looked at it as ridiculous by getting a little, getting over $1,000 for each dude that she did. You know what I mean? Each dude that she let run through her. You know what I'm saying? As, you know, and as you can see, you can see how much she value herself. She value herself enough to where she is happy and can brag on no jumper about doing 35 dudes at one time and getting paid over a thousand for each dude. You know what I'm saying? That's how much she value herself. You know what I mean? Because just that the, the risk, the risk. I guess that just don't outweigh the reward, you know what I mean, which is crazy, but it is what it is, but I'm not even trying to talk about her, I'm talking about us, y'all got to understand the energy that we take in when we watch these porn stars, it's a darkness that comes with that, you know what I mean, it's a darkness that comes with that, and I want y'all to understand that type of energy is what we don't need, that type of energy is what sucked us dry, of our energy. You know what I'm saying? That's what sucked us dry in our life. So we got to understand, man, that is not the way to go. It is not, that's not the way to go. Yeah. You know, you're going to have people that's going to say, man, it's normal for you to, you know, masturbate and do all of this and fap and all of that shit. But listen, man, we look a little bit deeper into things than just busting the nut. We looking into, we talking about the energy that comes behind that. Now I want y'all to think, right? Think about all of the fapping that you've done over time and think about where your life is at now. Think about the time. Think about even the moments that you were in, you know what I mean? To where you was constantly fapping all the time and think about how you felt around that time. Where were you at in your life? Were you, were, were, was you where you wanted to be? Answer, ask yourself, was you where you wanted to be at when you was doing all of that, when you was watching all of that porn constantly? Was you in a relationship that you wanted to be in? You know what I mean? Was your finances good? You know what I mean? Was you, was you, was you working on yourself at that time? You know, was you, when you was doing all that fapping, were you at where you at? Was you at where you at right now? Ask yourself that. Ask yourself that because if now... You know what? You left that shit behind you. Even though we still have our struggles, we left that shit behind us. Listen, I'm in a better position now that I don't have to worry about that. Now that I'm not taking on that type of energy. You know what I'm saying? And it's crazy, man. It's like, yo, that type of shit right there is like, yo, that is another reason why we don't need to be like, engaging in that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? You got a chick that's sitting there bragging about it and, and, and acting as if her, her vagina and her life is not worth it. Like her life was just like, this was just like a highlight of hers to get paid over a thousand to do 35 dudes, to let 35 dudes run in there at one time. And we sitting there looking at this chick on the screen, fapping away. And it's not just her. 
Listen, we taking in all types of energy from different porn stars that then been abused, then been used, then been sexually motherfucking assaulted, all types of shit that come behind these chicks. They didn't just wake up like this. You know what I'm saying? It's a reason why a lot of these chicks been molested. So I want y'all to understand the dark energy that we take in when we watch these porn stars. Look at her. Now, obviously, she is a beautiful woman. Okay. That's no doubt, but how she treat herself, how she value herself, that makes her ugly. That makes me not want any parts. My, my, my shit wouldn't go anywhere near hers. I tell you that much because you don't know what that thing got. You know what I mean? But still, even watching her through a screen, you still taking on that energy too. You got to understand that. Even watching her through a screen, you was taking in that energy. Like I said, your eyes is the window through your soul, to your soul. Understand your eyes is the window to your soul, man. So when you taking that in, you taking in her energy. You taking in all of that darkness that she didn't let enter inside of her. You know what I mean? So we can't do that shit, man. We wasted away our energy watching numerous porn stars with a dark past that come with dark energy that don't value themselves. So guess what? If we sitting there fapping away, giving away our energy to these porn stars that don't value themselves, what that say about you? You got to ask yourself that. What does that say about you? You sitting there looking at a screen, fapping to porn stars, fapping to these chicks that don't even value themselves. So you really got to be low to even have to resort to that. You have to resort to looking at a chick on screen that don't value herself, get ran through. So that says that you don't, you really don't value yourself because you're not even the one that's running through her. You watching her get ran through and you sitting there fapping to her on the screen. That's like you fapping to a chick or, or somebody that's just beneath you. You know what I mean? That, that, that you know is like at her wits end. You know what I mean? That's like you watching something that you know don't value. You know what I mean? Like they just have zero value for themselves and you sitting there enjoying that. You enjoying that. You you risking your energy, losing your energy, sitting there watching that. You watching her, somebody who have no self-worth. You know what I mean? No, no self-value. You know what I mean? No self-esteem. You know what I mean? I don't care what she look like, bro. Like at the end of the day, she clearly don't value herself. She clearly chooses money over her own well-being. So you cannot give anything like that your energy. And that's what I want y'all to understand moving forward. You can't give your energy to that because that makes you no better. That makes you no better sitting there fapping to somebody that you fap into a hurt person. You fap into a person that has zero value for themselves. So like I said, what that say about you? And we was doing a lot of that, wasting a lot of energy on that shit. And it really wasn't worth it. We could have been better in ourselves with that energy. We could have been doing so much with that energy. But instead, we watching a low value person just get ran through. And we sitting there fapping like we enjoy it. That's why you felt like you felt after you released. You was like, damn, what it why it felt like you it just drained everything out you, not just your semen, but your blood. You gotta understand when you release, it's like you lose what they say, like a, a hundred drops of blood. They say it's something like that, but when you release your energy like that, it do feel like you got drained of blood. You know what I'm saying? If for any of y'all that ever had to have labs taken, right? Where they take your blood, listen, that's why they tell you don't go work out. Don't go do none of that. You got to wait a certain amount of time because you weak and you can pass out if you go work out where, you know, where, where you don't have the uh, correct amount of blood, where that blood didn't re up in your body because they took. So whatever amount of tubes that they took in your blood. So you got to understand that. That's why you feel like that after you fat, you feel like not only did you release and lose your energy, but you feel like you lost like some blood. You feel like, what the hell? Why do I feel weak? I feel weak. I feel like I got no energy. That's why. That's why, because through that screen, she snatched all your energy and gave you nothing but dark energy and then drained you of the, the vitamins and minerals that you had in your body. 
Now your shit gone. And what you give it to? A screen. What you give it to? The dark energy that she has that you looking through that lens. And, uh, and guess what, man? People don't understand it. A lot of people going to listen. They're going to be like, man, whatever. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is, man. That's why you felt the way you felt. Because you don't know what type of energy these chicks come with. You know what I mean? You don't know that. But look at her. Look at her, man. Yeah, they do look appealing. These women do look, hey, hey they, they look very, very appealing. You know what I mean? They beautiful, you know, but you got to judge on the inside, man. You just can't look on the outside. You just can't. You got to understand, man. Listen, man, a lot of that shit, man, is, is, is deeper than what you thought, man. It's deeper than what we all thought, but we got to understand our energy and our value. And listen, we lower our value when we watch shit like that and we fat and lose our energy to that. That means we don't value ourselves. We wasn't valuing ourselves while we was fapping. So I want y'all to understand that, man. It ain't worth it. So keep doing what you're doing and move forward, all right? My name is Jason and CN Tape. Holla at y'all later, man. Peace. First, I'ma get on my grind. Then second, stop wasting my time. On shit less important. If ain't about money, I'm going the other direction. And third, I'ma do what I gotta to eat. Fourth, I'ma sew up the streets. Fifth, I'ma never quit dropping this heat. So as long as I'm breathing, you better get used to me. Sixth, I'ma get